Alright everybody, welcome back to EA Sports PGA Tour and the Open Championship has ended in real life. Um, so we're going to talk about it a little bit and we'll be playing a All-18 Sim at Royal Troon, South Ayrshire, Scotland. And let's see, 35 miles per hour, so wind not nearly as uh, prominent as it was in real life. Holy hell. This is EA Sports PGA Tour Golf. Hello again and welcome. I'm Rich Lerner. We will check in with Nota Begay the third and Iona Steven as we move along. But I'm pleased, as always, to be joined in the 18th Tower by a man who won 15 times around the world, Frank Novolo. And Frank, looking forward to what should be a fun afternoon of golf. Yeah, very much so, Rich. When you've waited all morning, those afternoon rounds are a little special, aren't they? I'm really looking, though, for today to see if they come out of the gates nice and quick, that's for sure. I know the finish here is always important, but get out of the gates quick and then see if you can finish the job this afternoon. All right, so, yeah. In the tournament, um, everybody was taking a four iron off of this tee, so, you know, let's, let's do that here. And this not the longest hole players and that's about what so they would just an iron off the they would end up with a good shot to perfection second shot straight ahead and we go to Iona Steven well it's 128 yards left to the flag to date wind into the face so you'll definitely need to account for that uh, I meant to go uh, well, a little over swing so oh never mind didn't need it Maybe a little too pumped up there. That just flew past the flag, but flew still past an outside I mean, chance high. for a birdie. What are you talking about, Frank? Um, but yeah, that was an ex that was a pretty exciting um, final round. I've got to say. Yeah. Oh, yes. on the first. Well Obviously, read. Xander Shoffley won at minus down. nine, Moving and on, then we you come had to the par four second. Billy Horschel at minus seven, and Justin Rose at minus seven. Um, they were tied for second, obviously. Um, and I was rooting for Billy just because you know it's, it would be his first major, and that one gonna be in great shape. So really, it is at one a solid first drive big here at win. The as well, I well, believe. It's 74 yards I could be wrong. He, he might have won. I, don't, I know he hasn't won. I don't think he won the players or anything like that. Um, but yeah. I was rooting for him, but Xander just could not be stopped. Sit. Ah, I knew that wasn't going to sit. Yeah, yeah going going six under that number, on that day. Really, the the, the final the day. day, everybody except for see, I think I believe Scheffler was one over. Um, but other than that, most everybody in the top ten to fifteen, most everybody was was level or under par. But yeah, you had, uh, I was thinking at one point Justin Rose might get it. Um, it's been 11 years for him as well. Winning a major, I do believe. Brush it in, and that'll be just a part. On to the third. Um, the South African, I cannot remember his name. Um, I was thinking at one point, I was like, oh man, this guy could, uh, could get it. But he kind of, he really kind of just fell off. I believe on the back nine. 
This right here, this Maybe is the one that Tiger one hits. You don't think you can reach the green, the so that a simple seven wood on the short par four and it works out. No, no, that's not. Never mind. This is Second a par shot. four. Good he did it green. on par five. Decent size green. It's not bad. Just a little bit. Lowry off. made a little bit of a comeback after a, feet away. a big kind of fall the day before. I mean, he he was set to win it, you know, coming in on Saturday with a pretty big lead, and he he got it to eight under at one point. Uh, good putt right there. His second birdie in these opening three on holes. Saturday. He gets it to two under par. And moving on, we come to then fell the all the way back four. to minus one. And it was just, it, you know, you hate to see somebody do that when, oh, no, I don't want to go there. I don't want to go in the rough. Oh, avoid the bunker. Damn. Oh my god, that is nope, literally that the worst the part right you could be in. Luckily, I didn't move this fall, gonna run off the fairway oh. and into the bunker. Probably get a pitching wedge out of this. Maybe. Yeah, we did. Yeah, that's a good shot. Sand takes away any chance of going for the green in two, but this yep. is a nice recovery here to get back on track. Well, it was definitely a fun watch. I was playing uh, my th rounds three and four, and also watch, uh, playing Alien Isolation while watching the, uh, the final round, so... Pretty good shot. I always looked inside that 15 feet circle. Anything inside that was going to be a good going shot. A, so a, a bit further that's right. That's a good shot. Then uh, I would have liked, but should get the birdie. Oh, okay. Yes, a good look at that one. Oh, way in. It's a birdie. Push that score to three under for the round. Uh, that long par three as well on Saturday. Um, it was a Daniel Brown and Shane Lowry both took a driver off, um, and they both went to that bunker. We'll, we'll see it obviously when we get to it, but. But yeah, when they were hitting their driver, I was like, "What the hell." I hadn't seen anybody take driver off, and okay, a friendly neither one of them are sure, you know, way onto the in terms surface. of length. Now this, for birdie. Obviously not yeah, the longest, the break, but you really got to consider here. It will come from right to left. You've got to start it on line, and you've got a good chance of getting it close. I uh, never started it on the line. Wow, that's fine. Went a little further than I would have liked. Oh, it never broke. Oh, okay. Listen, where's the turn? It didn't move nearly yeah, as much I saw as the one degree at my feet, and I decided to trust that. And shit. Two under on the deck. Now at the sixth hole. I'll say I realized that last second that I was hitting the power drive. That you will do just fine. 302 still to the hole. Still better than three bills away as he puts And I his can't hit driver the off the five. deck for some reason. Still don't understand why. I guess I need more in driving to do that. I have no idea. Oh wow, I didn't need it. Got to it with the three wheel. Yeah, mission accomplished. On in two. Didn't fly it all the way there, but got enough release in good shape. Well, if we can make this, that'll kind of make up for that bogey since this is a 
a very long par five. Unfortunately, didn't put enough break on it. Four feet now for birdie. Yes, a two putt birdie. That's in for a four. Continuing on with this front side, we head to the par four seven. Okay, we can take it over. Yeah, going to aim about right there. All right, come back. It's coming back a little bit, yeah. This round's been a clinic so far, and it's another great drive and another good opportunity to make another birdie. So after that bomb of a drive, this is second to the par four. And yet, yeah, with no rain to speak of, obviously it didn't rain the entire time. Hardly any wind. Okay, on the green, but let's go leave a putt that will get your attention. And even the rough, you can look at it and be like, oh, this isn't very tall at all. Um, sorely missed in this game. Oh my god, that was a good putt. Scoot a foot or two by. It was a bad second shot on, on my part, really. What the hell? Nearly a birdie putt. Oh, no, far is all he'll have to show for it. Settling in, hoping for a good one here. Oh man, in this three. hole, when uh, first time I noticed it on the final day, that it was only a hundred yards was in Rom when Rom was uh, hitting off. I saw it was only a hundred yards. I was like, what the hell? See, if, so if we stay a little long and go straight, it should come back into the right. So I'm aiming a little further to the further left than I normally would. Oh, I didn't mean to underswing it like that. See, I meant to go a few yards long. long. On the green, chance for birdie coming up. Whoops. Let's bring in Nota Begay the third for a look at birdie. Really not a whole lot to this. He's going to get a little help from the slope. Other than that, just slightly to the right. Oh, yeah, it was dead straight, almost. Just five feet left. Damn it. Okay, can't take that length for granted, but that's in for yeah, a final part. day. It was level par. Shoot it when it came back to. Well, it never. The lead was never less than four under on. Sunday. Bono was at four under, and this at one point, a little bit right. Uh, the rough. At one point, Rom so got it to two under. I believe he, with he drive, may not have gotten it to two under. Can't quite remember. But I was like, oh man, what if Rom made a comeback and and won this thing? Because. The only time they were ever talking about Rom, all I heard was, "Oh, well, really you know, ever long, since he miscalculated there. the well, there has to be something. I mean, from ever from since where this he year was, or something, it's just an aberration. Something. Seriously, that little green you know, patch down the end with a flag in it—that's where you meant to go, not how like used sailing to be over and all that. And, yeah. and I was like, he he hasn't played. He well, didn't play the open badly. Best, he did play the last Frank, two. If he's able to get out of here with this par, well, you might forget it. Majors pretty bad. It far from his best. But he played the open pretty well. Damn it! Mm, got it there, but not quite on target. I don't know. That chip running that far past is a little weird. Okay, so it's a bogey for him here at the ninth. Side starting now as we come to the part 410. Okay, so the fairway runs out at 338. Where am I aiming this? I don't even know where I'm aiming it. Okay.
Wow, still almost ran out of fairway. Never mind. So I must not have seen them play ten, this whole I don't second. remember it at all. What? Frank landed in the rough. The way uphill. Never gonna stop. No, no chance. What? I'm sorry, oh, that pitching nice. wedge shot Ball made absolutely no sense. Which one's a good decision, really, when you think about it? Ball sitting in the rough, not I mean, you too could bad. Say it you caught a flyer. Land soft, so the flop shot. Good but shot. the fact that it was so uphill. Yep, good work. Not to let that get away, and that's easy And I only block. took a few yards extra than where the pin was. I don't know. That didn't make any sense to me. Good I don't know why it was aiming me 20 yards left of where I put it. Now Noda, his second from the fairway. He's got 135 yards to the front, 155 to the hole. Pin is very accessible here, right in the center of the green. I didn't mean to underswing it by 3.7. And a good approach shot, just not quite not as close as what you like, but still solid. An outside look here for Birdie. Oh, my God. Mm, hang on. That's going to leave about three feet. Disappointment there. I'll brush it in, and that'll be just a par. But I got to say, the open, it, I think this year it kind of confirmed like that. It's definitely my favorite. Uh, tournament to watch because it really is just unlike any other tournament they yeah, play on the PGA Tour. Right. Um, it really tests everything so because of down in the rough. Just got the away rough, a little bit on that. You know the ball. bunkers, the weather specifically. Um, but so it's like. Ah, really, that comes back from the rough. Okay. Always a good shot in the rough, but now a chance for a birdie. So that's a good approach shot. Yeah, always my favorite one, and so glad I got to I got to watch the full third and fourth round. Oh my uh, god! That's a nice putt. Getting it up the hill. Was I caught wow. almost none of the first, and the and I caught the, the tail end of the second round. Really a birdie butt. Far is all he'll have to show for it. Yeah, yeah, I, I would say up, like it is the open four. is my favorite. Um, I I would say depending on the course. Um. The U.S. Open and the PGA Championship, one of those is usually my second because of the course. And the Masters, just because it's the same course every year, well, I think it's kind of like, eh, so no, it's in the rock, once you've seen it a while, it's, it's like, not in the fairway, but it, it's not a real fun to watch and everything, 13th, especially because it, it's second still shot. a big test for them and, you know. Good chance at one. Ah, oh, good shot again there. But, well uh, thought out. Landing the ball short, let the ball run onto the green. And inside, oh, I'd call that a birdie putt. So that's birdie range. Because this year's US Open was... Oh, what the fuck? Just going to sneak on by. See, and that one was where the lie angle was telling me 1.5, which is what it did. Oh, no, where is that going? How? How did it break two feet to the left, and then from where my ball was, break left? That's not how that works. 
That's one under on the day. Part three, Thank you, game, shot, for screwing me over there. Because again, the beads were absolutely not doing 1.5 degrees. But the lie angle said 1.5. Well, I had to choose that one, I guess. And didn't realize it. Oh yeah, we have to do the thing. Overdid it a little bit. It's still not a bad shot, really. And this is going to be in the short grass, just off to the left. A little short-sided here, left of the green for his second. Sand straight down the hill. Yeah. I didn't even want to land it on the green. And that's not what exactly ideal. Far from a tapping for his par. You're being too kind. I mean, that's not at all ideal. Nope. Didn't see the break. And that slides by to the it. left. Screw this game. Like, I mean, I should really only have to move it right here. Yeah. All right, good job to finish that one, but it is a bogey that'll move him back. Neither to the one of the last two holes the was the putt showing the anything of what hole. it did. And the uh, the other one just did com the complete opposite of what it should have done, so they screwed up mapping that hole. Just what you want at this point around, you're trying to find a rhythm, hit fairways. Hit the middle of the club face. That's what they did right there. Yeah, from I'm the fairway, Iona. This is second. 125 is the number. It's just a flip. And this, this is the worst the uh, the left portion of the green. tournament I've played in. And that ball looked I good in the air. You'd like to be a little PGA closer, Championship but still inside 40 feet. Just gonna minutes. have to be careful with the lag putting. It's at 0 0.7 degrees there. below, Coming which means I aim at left, and it went to the right. Oh, what fun. Yeah, good concentration there. That's a distance where a putt could get away, but that, in for a par. Screw it. I'll go... Straight over it. Don't even care. This is the par five. That's a good spot. Now from 200 yards, still got out with a dot. Button. This a second to the par five. It is one of the most satisfying shots in golf, isn't it? Down the end to a par five, the second, and we'll knock it on. Chance for eagle. Certainly shortens up the par five, that wind at your back, Rich, but you can just surf the wind. Just let that ball carry and just sail towards the green. Yep, not bad. Had to put a little extra into that one, but got it there. That's a pretty good effort. Okay, well deserved. Birdie down it puts him into red figures as well. Moving to one under par. This one right here, that long ass par three. I mean, holy hell. And left for some, no reason at all. Nope. Couldn't get the right shape on that one, and it'll miss the green left. Now, from off the green left, this is second. Yeah, so from where that is, I am in about a foot to the right. This is a nine-footer. About right there. Nope. Well, you could say I overhit that one, I guess.
Yep, that one goes down. It is a bogey, and that score Another will five, fall out five. of red figures as yeah. it's back to even par. in the short grass from an ideal location middle of the fairway this is second in golf you know you've heard the term mulligan you just have that do over there wouldn't you I mean, that's just oh, that's very poor from that range yeah i don't really care okay didn't quite get it there but that's a decent effort Okay, safely in for his par at 18. And this will wind up being a round of 71. Yeah, off a round. Well, that'll wrap it up for us today. We saw Played a lot like of great crap, golf. And right? they okay. uh, mapped out a couple of the greens horribly. But anyway, what did you guys think about the year open? I loved it this year. I absolutely love the course that they picked. You know, you love St. Andrews because it's so iconic, but... For me, in all reality, it's one of the more boring ones that they play just because unless it is incredibly windy the whole time and raining some of the time, it's not really that big of a test. I think Cam Smith won at, what, 17 under or something last year. Um, and this year, a lot of the majors... Um, Actually, I, I think the PGA Championship was like 16 under or something. I can't remember. Um, but it, I think three out of the four majors were less than 10 under par, and I think that's awesome. Um, but anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.